I thought you looked a little too cozy to wake up. We're in real. Here's your bag. Your parents are here. Come on. Will somebody please help me? What kind of airline is this? Oh, it's really jammed. Maybe you should get the pilot to give you a hand. What do you got in there? How long was I asleep? Maybe about a half an hour or so. I dreamt we made it to Rio. Don't worry, the rescue team will find us. <laughs> Good. You're awake. What's your name again? Will Bauer. Will. Maybe you can help us find some firewood. We need some dry kindling. Well, he should rest. We got about a half an hour of daylight left. You want to sleep tonight in the jungle without a fire? Everybody works, Miss Claire. Don't go too far. And don't pick up any sticks that move. You hear me? I should be singing in San Paolo tonight. God, Renato hates it when I disappoint my public. I was gonna sing Cruda Sorte. Cruel fate. Do you know Rossini's Isabella, Dr. Kenny? The plucky, shipwrecked heroine? It's Kennedy. And no, I'm a jazz fan. Well, yeah, I've never understood jazz. Nothing but squeaks and squawks. Like this place. It's getting dark. If 
find anything? Uh, pretty sorry dinner. What is it? It's related to passion food. I saw something like it in National Geographic. So you don't know? Great. That's all we need is a dose of poisoning. I think we'll live one night without food. Well, I can't. I'm starving. The airline food was atrocious. What is that? Food? Here. You can have my share. Thanks. Here. So what is this, fruit? I thought we came through there. Trust me, I was a pretty good Girl Scout. Why, just a lot of cookies? I know you've got them. Come on. Look, you seem like a really nice person. Pia, right? <sighs> it's just that I only got six of these left, and I don't see no 7-Eleven up a tree, so, um... Sorry, okay? I can't believe you're so selfish. So, when did my stuff become public property? You got to keep your purse for all I know you could be packing a carton in there. I don't smoke. It hurts my voice. Well, whatever. We're cool, then. I smoke when I'm nervous. And I'm nervous now. We have to help each other, don't we? We're supposed to share. Yeah, sure. Maybe the doc's got a plea you can pop. <sighs> Would you cut it out? Then give me one. No. No? No? Give me the matches. Give me the... Do that. Get. What the hell are you doing? Hey, you're gonna break them. Uh. Don't you realize how precious these are? Hey, look, she's the one getting all smoky the bear on me. Would you give me my stuff back? These belong to everybody. And these, they don't matter. Uh, don't! You happy now? You know you had no right that weren't yours! If you want a cigarette, you can come help look. I'm gonna call on by myself. Doctor, help nut. Come on, boys, Maria. It's the best that we could do. Stuff is green and wet. I can't use it. Okay, people. Listen to me. Predators feed at night. Okay, we have to have a fire. That means we need dry kindling. So dig into your pockets and your purses and give me whatever you got. I need gum wrappers, Kleenex, money, tampons, anything. A cigarette package? I do not care what you think about me. If I have to step on toes to get us through this night, I'll do it. This is not a dress rehearsal, Miss Claire. So wake up. Please. It's Pia, Doctor. My friends call me Miss Claire.
There's something out there. Something big. It was right beside me. It was like it was hunting me, like a, a tiger or something. There's no tiger here. There's jaguars. Look, I don't care what it was. It was there, okay? You saw a jaguar. You're sure? Look, I saw something, and it was a, whatever it was, it was a huge mother, like bigger than a Doberman. And I don't think they got dogs around here. So? Look, what are we gonna do, man? Empty your pockets. What? Just empty your pockets. I need anything that'll burn. Here. Look, if there's a jaguar out there, we need to fire now. What are you doing?